want to uh, just, here you go, yes. Let's hear it for J.P. Doyles, Brian Doyle, and Nikki Bell. Come on, let's, let's 20 years, guys. Beautiful day, start of a great day. We're going to start with Mayor Ray, who wants to make a few uh, announcements. Thank you. Thank you so much. As a longtime denizen of uh, Doyle's myself, uh, I still can't believe that it's been 20 years. Uh, it's pretty amazing. Uh, I'm joined today uh, by some folks that uh, wanted to also extend their congratulations um, to Brian and Nikki on this incredible anniversary. And uh, first up, I want to introduce um, County Executive George Latimer. Well, guys, we're here today to listen to great Irish rock music. We're here to enjoy uh, a fine adult beverage or two at each other's company for the afternoon. Now, I don't live in this side of the county, but when I'm on this side of the county, I am half Irish. County Roscommon, County Cork, and County Derry. So I always look for the best place to drink that's got an Irish name attached to it. And people told me, you go to Doyle's on Beekman, and that's where you have the best time. And that's why we're all here. So happy 20th birthday. May there be 20 more in the future. Uh, some of my colleagues in government will proclaim the day. We did too, but who needs another proclamation? Have a wonderful day. Enjoy it all together. One of those colleagues in county government is our county legislator, Margaret Kunzio. Mar Thank you very much. I actually come bearing gifts. I have a little something for you. Making it 20 years in any kind of restaurant business is a true milestone and a true accomplishment. And anyone that has worked in the food industry knows how difficult that is. It's not just about the food, it's about the community. J.P. Doyle's is a fixture here in Sleepy Hollow on Beekman. It's a place that we all gravitate to after the St. Patrick's Day Parade. It brings people together. And of course, tomorrow with the start of the National Football League season, it's going to bring a lot more people together here. I have a little something for both of you guys. So come on up. Thank you. On behalf of myself, it is my honor and privilege to have a proclamation here claiming Monday, September 9th, J.P. Doyle's Day in Westchester County. <laughs> Westchester County Center in White Plains, we have that giant jumbotron. On Monday, it is going to say JP's JP Doyle's Day in Westchester County. It will be on all day. Make sure you get down there. I will make sure to get pictures. I'll send them to you. But it will be there all day so everybody in Westchester County knows that JP Doyle's is the place to be. Thank you guys so much and congratulations. <laughs> Uh, and also joining us is Francesca Haggadis, who's on the town board representing the town of Mount Pleasant, which Sleepy Hollow is part of. Francesca. Hello, my name is Francesca Haggadis hyphenated McHale. I am so impressed with this crowd here. I am on the board of the town of Mount Pleasant. This is the town of Mount Pleasant, so don't forget that, please, that you are part of the town of Mount Pleasant. And we are so proud to have such a successful business, such a great place, a place where everyone can gather, and we are going to proclaim in the town of Mount Pleasant that Monday is J.P. Doyle's Day. So, thank you very much. And um, every day in Sleepy Hollow is J.P. Doyle's Day. Trustees are here to present a very small token um, of our uh, appreciation, our congratulations to Nikki and Brian um, in the form of a plaque. So, Sam and uh, Glenn and John, please join me here together. And you guys come forward and we'll give you this. Right up Brian, Nikki, we want to thank you on behalf of the Village of Sleepy Hollow, the Mayor, Ken Ray, myself, Sam, the other trustees, Glenn, Deputy Mayor. Not only are you a, a, a really treasured business in our village, but what you guys do for the people in Westchester County, it goes unnoticed sometimes, but you guys are the most generous, compassionate, caring people to own a business ever, I think. So 
I'm, I'm, I'm not going to get teary-eyed. Uh, congratulations on continued years of dedicated business in Sleepy Hollow. Glenn, read the next part. In grateful appreciation for 20 years of outstanding service and commitment to the village of Sleepy Hollow, I'll just add that Brian and Nikki and the entire staff at Doyle's, they make Sleepy Hollow a better place every single day, and we're so fortunate to have them to be such an important part of our village. Hold it up with them. Hold it up. Hold it up and take it a shot. Get in. Sleepy Hollow Fire Department, which is actually making its way in right now. So uh, please make room for the uh, fire truck coming in. Bell's parents who had just flown in from Ireland. <laughs> and uh, Nikki did not know about this. Give the Bell parents a hand, please. Please. But Steve, you could turn my mic down now. Chick, 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 thank you. Hi guys, it's Jen, and I know you know me, and I was here, I painted the walls before you guys opened. I was actually one of your first servers here 20 years ago, and I'm so proud to say that I was there, and I, I am so amazed by what you guys have done. You're truly fantastic. You've run a fantastic restaurant, and I just wish you all the best. I wish you all the best for another 20 years. You guys are truly, truly amazing. Love you so much. And But anyway, this one's called Pumps, Pints, and Open Doors. It's about uh, their trip out there. And uh, this one out to all of you guys.
best I can I walk the beaches in the north I hike the far run up the walls Stood on hilltops and I sang like I never sang before East to Mayo, it's rocky shores and pints and open doors He's the dairy and our people's street He's the Dublin as I watch the sun I don't want to be uh, commemorating uh, the 18th anniversary of September 11, 2001 and uh, where the hell does 18 years go? But uh, if you guys didn't know this already Brian Doyle Brian Doyle is a New York City firefighter in, uh, in the 13th Battalion the FDNY. Quite possibly. Hold on one second. What do we got? Do I do this now? Hi, everybody. Is this a great block party or what? Yeah! My name is Pete Harkin. I'm your New York State Senator. Just wanted to stop by briefly, and we brought the New York State Majority Leader of the New York State Senate, Andrea Stewart Cousins. And J.P. Doyle's has been such an institution that we wanted to come on behalf of all of our colleagues and all the people of New York State to say happy birthday, say congratulations, and say thank you. This is really a wonderful, wonderful day. What better way to bring the community of Sleepy Hollow together? Thank you for everything you've done. And I am so proud now to introduce someone who used to represent Sleepy Hollow before I did, the Majority Leader of the New York State Senate, Senator Andrea Stewart Cousins. think of a better reason to be in Sleepy Hollow today than to celebrate J.P. Doyle's restaurant and public health. I had the honor of representing Sleepy Hollow back in 2007 through 2010 and along with working with, with Mayor Ray and, and all of the wonderful officials one of the places that I knew I could go get good food, hospitality, friendship, and any help I needed was at J.P. Doyle. That's why we're here. And Senator Harkum is carrying on that tradition and when Brian and Nikki and Ken said, you gotta be back here for this celebration, I made sure I could be back. First of all, to say thank you to Sleepy Hollow for being an incredible community and to collectively say thank you to J.P. Doyle for being a great business, a great neighbor, a great giver to the community, and we wish you all the best for the next 100, 120 years. So on behalf of the State Senate, we have a proclamation that says all the good things you already know. And we are so proud to represent you in the State Senate. So thank you so much, Brian and Nikki, and Nikki's family. Congrats, all the way from Ireland. Yeah. Have a good time, everybody. Thank you, musicians, for great music. to be here today for the 20th anniversary of J.P. Doyle's. We've been coming here the whole time. Um, Sleepy Hollow Native. Can't say enough about Brian and Nikki. They they have done every kind of party for us from christenings to confirmations to communions to funerals. I just can't say enough about them. And congratulations. Here's to another 20. All right. Hey, guys. This is Nick. Um, I work with Jägermeister, so Brian and Nikki. I would like to thank you guys for inviting Jägermeister into uh, this wonderful uh, festivities. Uh, we thank you for your support. I um, hope this is a blast. 
and I'm having a great time. So all the best and hope to continue to partner with you guys in the near future. Snow in the air, winter is here, the wind is blowing, lights are so clear, there's presents to wrap, and cars to sound, it's Christmas in New York again. There's somebody singing a holiday song. You pick up the tune and start singing along. You learn the words sometime way back when. Cause it's Christmas in New York again. Fancy store windows and millions of lights. Downtown in December. What a fabulous sight. You spin round and round trying to take it all in. Cause it's Christmas in New York again. As you gather around the table with everyone, still feel that something has been left undone. Tree is all trim, shopping is through. There's one nice thing you still have to do. It's Christmas Eve, 11 p.m. You walk down to the church, quietly go in, kneel down in the last pew, right on the aisle. I say, God, I know that it's been a while. Can you do me a favor on this Christmas Eve? Can you send out some blessing to people for me? You know these last few months have been kind of tough. We can all use a little love. So bless New York's finest, our angels in blue. Give all our soul and they're helping us through. Bless New York's greatest, the FDNY. Giving their sweat and their tears and their lives. And bless all the best. And our troops overseas, bless the guys in the hard hats for food and debris. Bless the everyday people who answer the call. Bless those who gave some and those who gave all. And bless all the souls who left us this year. You may be gone, but you'll always be here. Singing and dancing with family and friends. Cause it's Christmas. In New York again, and there's snow in the air. Winter is here, the wind is blowing. Nights are so clear, there's presents to wrap, and cars to send. It's Christmas in New York again. La 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 and then we drink, everybody, because that's what we do. Yeah! Oh, no! Their staff, their staff is amazing. I have been so happy. I'm lucky with all their future. We're here, and they're opening the room with a addition. Amazing, 25 you opened this place. I was here, it was an amazing night, and now we're here again 20 years later. Amazing, good luck. Here's to the next 20 years. Lori Gomes, hi Nikki and Brian. We just wanted to um, wish you a wonderful anniversary. You guys have built such a beautiful place that helps families come together, and we were so glad to be a part of it. Here we go.